DJ Ned, what is a city air culture? I don't know. Do you DJ Game on our? No, absolutely not. We love Derby. A city of culture. Hello, my name is Adonia and I am an artist from Derby. Now, what City of Culture would mean for me is having the opportunity of having safe spaces developed for the purpose of creative expression within Derby. It would also mean more of a forefront representation of my identity and others like me within Derby. I believe this would be key to the city's overall evolution, making it a more pivotal uh, gear and hub within the creative and innovative sectors of the nation allowing for more job opportunities, allowing for further creation of the arts, uh, which come out of Derby. It would also create a sustainable bridge between different communities through the use of these safe spaces. Safe spaces which should honour all individuals, which come from all walks of life and cultures worldwide, which currently reside in Derby and have also been a very important part to the city's growth. Did you know? Derby had the first public park in England. Hiya, my name is Alex. I'm an artist from Derby, originally from Poland. I specialize in graphic design, illustration and participatory work, looking at awareness and engagement in different groups and communities in Derby. The city of culture would mean a lot to me and to Derby, looking at how much Derby has to offer. The city is rich in history and culture, deriving from communities and groups living here. I wasn't even aware of all the incredible history it has, such as the Rolls Royce Museums and Arboretum, which are just few of the examples. The art scene is flourishing with festivals, galleries and public art. Derby is in the heart of England and it connects a lot of people coming from different locations, cities and communities. I think City of Culture would definitely bring all these aspects together and showcase Darby's amazing talents, potential and achievements in many, many ways. And I'm really excited to be contributing to this as an artist. Very good morning to you. Now, young people in Derby are sharing their ambitions for their home to become City of Culture in 2025. A creative community space called Shed is travelling around the area this weekend and will be broadcasting young people's voices talking about their aspirations. It will also start conversations to help with Derby's bid to become the UK City of Culture. Now, here's what some of the children have had to say already. Our voices... Our future... And the idea really is about us trying to find alternative ways to create spaces for people to talk, sometimes about things that are really hard to talk about, but we absolutely need to be discussing um, in a safe space. And also to invite people who might not get invited to be parts of really important decision making processes and conversations to be invited into the shed to have those conversations with policymakers. Rihanna, it sounds absolutely brilliant. Um, T, just tell us, what's your involvement? Hi, yeah, so my involvement um, started with the last shared programme that took place in Derby. Um, we, um, I was kind of commissioned to create something, um, you know, that was meaningful. Again, the question was culture. So um, it made me as a photographer, I guess, um, kind of think outside the box and try and um, capture... Uh, different elements of culture within Derby. So it made me actually ask the question, what is the culture in Derby? Which was quite interesting. Kids to the future. <laughs> no grown-ups, only kids. Avatar, gone. <laughs> <laughs> 